Today we're going to be looking at cleaning and maintenance of air fryers. So regardless of what model of the Philips air fryer you have, they're all cleaned and maintained in the same way. So daily cleaning requirements are that if you've cooked anything that has fat or oil, you are going to get a build up of fats and oils in the bottom of the frying basket. So release the frying basket, make sure you're using you know, heat resistant cloths if you need to, um, or make sure that the machine has cooled down sufficiently. And in this catchment area, you're generally going to end up with a pool of oil. Now this oil needs to be captured somewhere and thrown out before you go ahead and wash these drawers. So what I tend to do is get an old jam jar or an old tin and have that somewhere in the kitchen and collect all of your excess oil that's been drained from the air frying procedure. The interesting thing about that is, is that you can visually see how little oil you're putting into your foods, but how much oil you're taking out of them through this unique frying process. So it's a really good visual, but also a safe and environmental way of capturing this without it going down the sink. So whether it's the olive oils or the oils that don't tend to solidify or the animal fats that do, the good thing about this, as I said, is you get to actually see where it's going, which is in the rubbish instead of into your system. So we'll get rid of all of that first, make sure it's put away safely. Once that's done, these two drawers, so whether you have the extra large or the regular size air fryer, they require hand washing, so regular hand washing as you would anything else in your kitchen sink. And then of course, once they're dried, they go back together and go into the machine. So that is your daily cleaning. Now maintenance, long term maintenance on this machine. This is a frying machine, make no doubt about it. There's a lot of oil and fats and, and stuff going around in with that air. So you will get a slight build up of oil within the Philips air fryer. So if you notice a lot of excessive smoke coming out from this air vent in the back. So this is the air vent here. If you notice an excess amount coming from there, it's probably time to do a maintenance clean on this machine. So how we do that is, Firstly, make sure that the machine is completely cooled, so make sure it's safe to be able to handle. Of course, unplug it, so take it away from any power source. Remove your frying baskets and clean those as you normally would. Turn the air fry, so regardless of whether it's the extra large or the regular size, pop it upside down and what that allows you to do is to see in there and actually see where the fat buildup is so that we can go ahead and clean with different cleaning tools. So. A soft bristled brush will mean that you can clean around here on the element and remove excess fat and grease buildup. So we can be using that on the element. We can be also using these types of cleaning sponges. Be sure that you're prepared to throw them out because the amount of fat and oil and excess grease buildup that you're going to get on some of these is going to be astounding. So give everything a really good wipe out, wipe the back of the machine and make sure that you clean all around that element and then of course whatever's on there you don't want so we're going to throw that cleaning cloth away and that is your quarterly maintenance I like to call it so I recommend that people clean like that at least once a season so four times a year at least if you're seeing excessive smoke you may be using your air fryer a lot more than other people so you may need to do it a little bit more regularly so perhaps once a month doesn't take long, it takes a couple of minutes, it's really easy, you need no chemical cleaners, um, so it's not a, a, a time consuming or difficult job to do. So what that means is if you have an excess buildup of fat and grease and oils within your Philips air fryer, you're not going to get an excessive amount of smoke coming out of that exhaust system. 